Taylor Swift's alleged burglar Roger Alvarado made himself at home when he broke into her brownstone on Friday, after allegedly smashing through a window with his hand. Robert hopped into her New York City pad, took a shower, and fell asleep in her bed, according to TMZ. So weird, right? Luckily, Taylor was not at home at the time of the incident. But, thanks to her trusting neighbor who called the cops, Roger was arrested inside the home. He was charged with stalking, burglary, and criminal mischief. Sadly, this isn't the first time Taylor experienced stalking. On April 14, a man named Julius Alexander Sandrock was arrested and taken into custody for felony stalking. According to the Beverly Hills Police Department, Julius allegedly tried to break into Taylor's California home wearing a mask and rubber gloves. He was also in possession of a knife, live ammunition, and black rope. What a nightmare. But again, Taylor was not home at the time. Phew. However, the Beverly Hills PD filed a temporary restraining order, and an emergency protective order against Julius after finding latex gloves, prescription medications, an empty gun holster, and more open his car. We hope this is the last scary run in Taylor has. Aside from her many burglary attempts, Taylor recently made headlines for returning to country music. The singer, who's commonly known for her pop love songs, is featured on Sugarland's new track Babe and it's as epic as you'd imagine. The song, written by T-Swift herself, was released on April 20th, and boy is it good.